In this video, we're going to look at these examples on page 21 of the chapter 5, section 1 slides. First, we've got how much money should be deposited in a bank paying interest at the rate of 6% per year compounded monthly, so that the, at the end of three years, the accumulated amount will be $20,000. For this problem, we use our formula for present value, which is P equals A times one plus I to the negative N. So um, in this problem, we're given R is 6%, so that's 0 0.06. M equals 12. And this is over three years, so and T is three. So I is R over T, and that's 0 0.06 over 12. And N is going to be M times T, so that's 36. So we plug in these values, oh, and A, it's 20,000. So P equals 20,000 times 1 plus 0 0.06 over 12 raised to the 36th, negative 36th power. That comes to approximately $16,713. In the next problem, we're asked to find the present value of $49,158.60 due in five years at an interest rate of 10% per year compounded quarterly. So here we're using that same formula, which was again, P equals A times one plus I to the negative N, here A is 49,158.60. Um, T equals 5. R equals 0 0.10. So I is going to be, we're doing this quarterly, so that's 0. 0 0.10 over 4, which is the same as 0 0.025. And N is 5 times 4, or 20. Plugging everything in, we get P equals 49,158.60 times 1 plus 0 0.025 raised to the 20th power. Plugging this into our calculator, we have 30,007. So $30,000.07 that we need to deposit, approximately 30,000, in order to get our. Um, in order to get that $49,158.60 at the end of 10 years. That's it for these problems. If you have any questions, get in touch.